that Zach Stace fell back in the net tonight was the winner in that uh, contest on Friday night. Mike Hastings, 11th year for the Mavericks, and his good friend Scott Sandlin on the other side for the Bulldogs in his 23rd year behind the bench for Minnesota Duluth. You guys don't quite know where they should be yet. Morton for Hiroshi down low. Mavericks got a break. Score! <laughs> Bulldogs got caught up along the blue line. The Mavericks saw it, recognizing a couple quick passes, and Celia puts the Mavericks on the board with a power play tally at 8.29. There you see Celia right there with the glass, and he took the one five time feed from behind the uh, goal line, and Stacebell really didn't have much time to react. Draw, goal scorer there, Celia, able to get it ahead for Grohl. Played along in front of the... Penalty boxes and Celia digs it out of some traffic. Between the circles, a score! That yeah, just grit and determination. He's got a D all over him. He's got presence in front. Right, he's got Grohl giving him a good screen, attacking the net. Morton, Hiroshi, near side for Livingstone. Right in on net, tipped there by Borchard. And it's covered up on a really good save by Stacefall. Both the save and not giving up the rebound because the Mavericks were looking weak side with Morton. Livingstone, Morton, Carroll with 10 seconds left. Down low, weak side, score! Lucky bounce there for the Mavericks and Livingstone with a lot of time to work, took his time. Stacefall had to honor the shot attempt on the far side, but when the Karen came weak side, Andy and Mavericks go up 3-0. Oh, but there it is. It's net front presence. You have, you have Kate Borchardt setting up shop right in front, setting up a good screen. You get pucks to the net, and good things happen. This is how a power play is designed. Great net front presence. He's got a D work in the backside. Bondarchuk is off on a high stick at 229. Mavericks five on three for a few more seconds here. Score! Lots of room on the ice, a great feed through the slot, and the Mavericks with Borchert finding the net, and he gets his first goal of the season in the Mavericks on top, 4-0. You know, when Dick Livingstone gives you a pass across the seam, you need to have strong bottom hand pressure. He zipped this puck through, Borchardt catches it, but man, did that puck come through there quick, and Borchardt makes no mistake about it, goes right under the bar. Up on top for Wheeler, Perosi. Wheeler is the Bulldogs back at full strength. Hiroshi down low, loose puck, score! That's an even strength goal as Francis had just gotten out of the box a few seconds before. Stacekull just could not dive back into the net in time to pull it out of the blue or the line. And then uh, Pavel got in there. Gregor was down low as well. It would be interesting who here gets credit for the goal. Yeah, and that's one of those as a goal. Looking at slow motion, right? It's Bill Mock is off on the trip. Mavericks technically on their seventh power play of the night. Souter out in front. Score! Souter got it down to Borchert, who then fed it right through the top of the crease. Morton one times it for the sixth goal of the night for Minnesota State. Carter Loney now carried down by Spicer, left off for Gallatin. Dashkey, low height. Through a couple of players, Spicer, but that one, I think that was Hiroshi with the defensive play there on the stick to uh, take it up and out of play as well. Yeah, and from what I can see, I think that's, uh, I think that's Tracy coming up with the save, so. Yeah. They're not going away quietly right now. Connor Grega with a 6 nothing lead still jumps out there and blocks that blast from the point. So I, that's the type of ho hockey Coach Hastings loves to see. And a fantastic save as James on a rebound had a really good look. And Tracy gets the blocker down. Played off for James. Tip back for Olsen. Puts a shot that kind of knuckles in on the play. So not the easiest save of the night for Tracy. But he's down to 10 seconds left before his first victory. 
Mavericks with three back in the first, just continue to uh, put the uh, pedal down in the contest, and that will do it. And on a shutout effort, his first ever collegiate game for Alex Tracy, the Mavericks just win this one tonight by a score of six to nothing. <laughs>